Oh, I don't know. What, uh, okay, please be most. My, sorry. The um, moment of the game, the best uh, I enjoyed the most was the 92nd minute. Yeah. Yeah, it's, I think it's already 5 or 6 1, and we will lose the ball, and four players chase him. Chase the poor, poor player from Leeds in that moment down. I think that's the basis for the whole game. Um, because gave, that gave us stability. It was, from a counter pressing point of view, definitely the best game we played this season. Um, in possession, probably as well. Being calm, prepared with little passes, preparing uh, direction in a really good way. At least three goals we scored after counter press, uh, which is obviously massively helpful. Um, and so, and then we were calm in the in the in the decisive moments to pass except to pass exceptional balls. I think Mo's second was um, super play. But I'm not sure was it Curtis to Robbo and then Robbo or, or maybe Joe, uh, and then yeah, and then Cody and then going the ball. Two more, so that was really, really good. A lot of good moments. Um, last goal, sensational pass from Trent, and um, Darwin can finish it off. So, um, yeah, it was a good game. And for Diogo, big for him to have waited so long for a goal. <laughs> yeah, yeah, injured too long, eh? so same like um, Lucho, um, and that's um, obviously tricky. Diogo was involved in a lot of top top moments, like won the ball back before the first, set up the first for more. Um, but still, you can see there's space for improvement. We have some moments where you can see the rhythm, maybe not not 100 percent, but um, so the front three played tonight. They could it could have had a completely different front three, but because of the way. Um, they defended tonight. That was the important part of it because football, they all can play football, but we need to understand that it starts there. Um, I think the counter pressing mode was set by Curtis and Hendel. It was absolutely top how they um, um, chased pretty much every everything on the pitch. That was super important, but I didn't remember a situation where Robbo was in a 1 1 situation or Trend was a one-one situation because we were always moving to the ball side to so many important things, and um, yeah, I liked it a lot. We have to cap up here for like, really away from home when you can bring on Luis Diaz for his, his first game in six months. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, super important. So Luis is back. He's, he's now lacking rhythm, which is normal. Bit of sharpness. But that's normal as well. So it's in training sessions. It's not you cannot get there to the final degree of, of sharpness. Um, so we now try to just um, help him getting step by step back really into the team to getting a mi uh, giving him minutes and um, yeah. But it's just nice to see him play. To be honest, um, I missed him so long. So it's just nice to see him being involved again. Okay. He won the ball back for the first goal from that position as well. So like stepping really out, yeah, yeah, no, was good, <laughs> was good, yeah, yeah, impressive. I think it was, uh, the highlight was then the last pass, but he had a few more from that position. So um, yeah, um, uh, wherever Trent is, he can be decisive with his passes. He was as very often for us. That's how it is. And um, tonight was a, was a good game. You could see that he enjoyed it. Chris. I don't know. I don't know what we, what we will lead to, but I said it now in all TV interviews already. So it's super important what's happening from now on because it all gives us information. Because it will go on after that, eh? so there will be a next season. So I have no clue where we can end up this season. I don't just don't know because it depends massively on all other teams around us. So so many teams are in front of us and they can win all their games as long as we don't play them. Can win all their games without we can anything do against that. So. Um, yeah, but that's now in the mo in this moment not too important. What is important that we um, what we showed in the second half against Arsenal because I think after in that season we all agree this game could have gone either way. Yeah, tuning down early, Arsenal is flying, 
and they scored a third, they scored a fourth, poof, and you have a real problem. So, but we reacted well and um, got the point which we deserved the least, I would say. Um, and tonight now, super important that we really understand uh, what we got here. We play a really bad season, but some things are not really to explain, something are, some things are definitely to explain and not acceptable, but now we have, when we put in good performances, we can understand what's possible. So, and um, that's really, really important for me, and that's why I don't think where we will, where we can push to or whatever. Just, I just want us to play top football and play and win, win games, and, and then we will see where we end up.